Hello there. Let's talk about unique tokens, some call them non-fungible tokens or NFT. Popular blockchain games like CryptoKitties make use of non-fungible tokens. In this video I will show how simple it is to program a unique token using BlockTalk for Burst. Download the BlockTalk project from GitHub. Open the project on VS Code. Open the source folder and then sample. You will find the unique token sample. In this sample we have a unique token smart contract. Essentially, this contract has an owner. Only the owner can control the contract. Further, this contract also includes a built-in decentralized exchange to sell the token. This is taken care by these additional variables. Putting a token on sale is the focus of this video. This is handled by two methods. The put on sale method should receive the sale price and quant and the timeout. Only the owner can put a token on sale. And then there is the buy method. This method checks if the sale is still open and if enough burst was transferred. Let's add breakpoints on these methods to see how it works. We will start the emulator with two tokens already created programmatically. Click on debug to start the emulator. Here we have our two tokens, both owned by the creator. Let's put token 1 on sale. The first argument is the token price in quant. Let's set it as 100 million quant, which is one burst. For the timeout, let's set it as 100 minutes. Send and then forge block to confirm. The execution halts on the breakpoint and we can step over the code. Token 1 is now for sale. Let's add a buyer to the game. Buyer will buy token 1 by transferring 2 burst, one for the activation fee, and another to pay for the token. Again, we can step over the code to see the process taking place. Now token 1 is owned by the buyer. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share and subscribe. Block talk. Easy to use smart contracts for burst.